uppercuts that a lot of people are familiar with is uh, liver shot. And um, if you could see his body mechanics, he is basically leaning his body to the right. He's, he's kind of tilting his body slightly to the right in his thorax. So he's bringing his body slightly to the right in his thoracic cage and loading his, the back of his buttock right over here. Mm. At the same time, while he's spinning, he's kind of creating a spinning motion over mm. here with his with his leg. Are you doing any twisting of your knee here? Yes, I'm is twisting there? a little. Okay. Just a little. So he's actually creating most of his force with isometric contraction of gluteus maximus. Again, the gluteus maximus is always on. It's, it's loading him over here, but he's transferring that by squeezing and isometrically contracting. Mm -hmm. And he's side bending away uh, towards the same side will, while creating that rotatory force. To, to create that liver shot. True. All right? right? So, guys, the wrong way to do it. Now show right. us the wrong way that you see a lot of fighters doing now, it the wrong way. The wrong way is, one, you step up and you're flat, both feet together. Two, to throw the punch out, in. So, to go a negative back to positive is waste of energy. Okay? That's the wrong way. Because again, too much targets here. I can't get out the way if I need to. And this is not going to generate the shock that I want. I want huge shock right here. Even if I hit his elbow, I want shock. I want a, a huge shock. So the proper way is center gravity, turn. I don't open my arm. I lock my elbow and fist, lock my wrist, and generate power right all this generate power, shock the liver. And you're basically generating the, the whip yeah. from the, t the, the hip again, guys. You can actually see that right hip in the back is isometrically contracting, co-contracting, getting his gluteus maximus to hold him in position so that he can dissociate or take away uh, load from here. This is actually just a spinning moment right here. He's just spinning through his thorax. He's creating a spinning moment okay when that spinning moments happening it's happening from here from the whip of his knee so he's creating that that right there bam do you see that everything is happening from his deceleration he's decelerating over here his his hip extensor his gluteus uh, medius which is over here the fan muscle the deltoid of the hip so to speak and his gluteus maximus are decelerating him slowly okay as he enters that so you need control Control over these muscles over here yes. in a slow motion fashion. Almost if you like a baseball pitcher, you're not just going to let go of the ball. You're yeah. going to slow it down like that. Mm -hmm. And that's what he's doing with his leg over there. His hip is actually slowing down slowing the contraction. Down. Mm -hmm.